Welcome back everyone. This is another one of my tutorials and today we are going to build ourselves my Damp Farm Mark III. This is a slightly altered version from the previous one which I've showed you. The only thing that's different is that they actually use fence gates and a lever for simplicity. So let me show you how this one works real fast walk up. You notice that it looks pretty good in there, that you want to take the stuff. Flip switch. Head on in. Get all your loot. And before you leave, you till the land. Oops. Close the gates if you want to. And put the land back down. And it should... Uh, you should be perfectly fine after that. Okay, let's go ahead and uh, start building one ourselves. This model is, what is it? It's a 10 by 6. So it's 10 long by 6 wide. Um, we're actually going to use a little bit of this space for the switch as well. So it's about 11 by 6. So let's go on over here and start digging our hole. We want to start with uh, a 4 wide, by 8 long by 3D pull. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 2 more. Okay. Okay, now that that's done, we want to go down here and dig out a couple of side paths. In these, we're going to fill them with redstone. Okay, directly in front of that redstone, we want to add some repeaters. All facing inwards, like this. And over here, in the center, we want to add all sticky pistons. Okay, now that that's done, let's go ahead and start putting the places for our water. What we're going to do is in each one of the corners, it doesn't really matter which one, on either side, um, we are going to dig down two and we are going to put a block above our repeater. In these holes, we're going to place water. Cool, cool. That water will be used to hydrate the whole field. Now what we want to do is start filling in the land. Okay. And okay, now that that's done, let's go ahead and oops, put the glass above here. This glass will be used so that whenever we're in the farm, we don't have a way of getting to the crops which are under the glass. Now that this is all done, let's go ahead and till out all the land. So that we can start planting our seeds. And let's get some seeds. Pumpkin and melon seeds. Really doesn't matter which kind of seed you you use. It's all going to be the same. Uh, they both work. I mean, okay. Those stalks will be able to grow because of the glass above them, and also they'll be able to give off fruit because there's glass above them. If there's a solid block, I have noticed that if there's a solid block above these plants they do not give off fruit. Also when these center blocks are raised up like this and these if, if these were solid blocks 
um, you would create a pitch black area around your crops. Um, and doing that would make them pop out of the ground as seeds, and you do not want that. You want them to stay in there forever. Okay. Now this is a pretty much a done farm, other than putting the switch and the fence up. Now that that's done, what we're going to do is go ahead and dig out a hole so we can start wiring our switch. Uh, make sure you don't get rid of this block because it's holding in the water. Cool, cool. Or this one as well. Go ahead and dig and dig. That should be perfectly enough. Cool, cool. Go ahead and dig it over now towards the redstone over here. There we go. And we're going to put a block back here, put some redstone on top, and run the wire this way as well. Um, this is just long enough so you don't have to use any repeaters to reach the last pistons. Okay, cool. Let's go ahead and fill this back up. We're going to add our switch and watch it work. Here's our switch. And there we go. We have a working farm. Now the only thing to do is to build us a fence and to keep all of the animals out and this is completed. Thank you guys for watching. Um, I plan to keep on improving on my designs. This is of course my Mark III design. Um, go ahead and look over to my previous Mark II buildings. Um, Mark II is here. And I am going to release also um, my world for download again so you guys can take a look at my Mark IV. In the future, I will be building a completely fully automatic, no worries, uh, damp farm as well. So you guys have a great day, and thank you for watching.